hear the word summer slide, you know your kids are thinking about those water park slides they'll soon be spending time at. Yeah, we're talking about a slide of a different <laughs> kind, though, when kids forget some of what they learned over the summer breaks. And as Madison students wrap up their school year today, Christina Laurie is live with some strategies that you can use to help avoid that. Good morning, Christina. Good morning, Josh and Leah. So kids tend to lose their reading skills during the summer months first. So this morning we're focusing on ways you as a parent can help prevent that. The U.S. Department of Education has been studying this phenomenon known as the summer slide for decades now. And they have some simple strategies. First, they suggest building a fun reading space, like setting up a reading fort with pillows and blankets plus a basket of books to make a relaxing spot for reading. A reading routine is also really important. Kids thrive on these, so set aside a specific time every day to dedicate to reading. Your kids also look to you, so be a good role model. Actually get caught reading. When kids see you enjoying a good book, they'll follow your lead. Also make sure books are easy to find in your home. Keep them in your car, too, so you can bring them out for doctor's visits, shopping trips, and long waits. Another piece of advice, reading should not be considered a chore. So in order to make it more enjoyable, actually give your kids a choice. Let them pick out what they want to read, whether that's a recipe, a magazine. I knew when I was growing up, I loved reading a series of unfortunate events. They say series are especially good during the summer months because you get hooked and you want to read book after book after book. But do you have any favorites that you wanted to talk about? Die hard Harry Potter fan. Die hard. To this day, I would reread those books. What do you ask? See, I never got into Harry Potter, but what? I loved Beverly Clearly, The Mouse Motorcycle, okay. Runaway Ralph. Those were good. Those were good, too. What? Did you see my jaw drop? You never got into Harry Potter? I Who never got I? into Harry Don't Potter. Don't announce that on television. I know. Oh, that's terrible. I've gotten a lot I'm going to walk away. <laughs> yes, I know. I've gotten a lot of... Uh, <laughs> For that before a lot of grief. Christina and I will lend you the books. <laughs> we'll see. All right, Christina Laurie reporting for us. Thank you, Christina. Thank you, guys. All right, six oh.